Да, обдейг. Big old piece of wire. Big bit of brass. Clean that lighter and see what we can find on it. Ooh, 50 cal. Cool. Now they come up around the trees. Uh, I suppose when the trees grow up, they drag stuff with it. And some of that plate that we found when we first pulled up could actually be part of the 50 cal case if it's been a bush fire object. Mm, a bit deeper. Yeah, I should have gloves on, shouldn't I? So that 50 kilo cut. There's been a lot of um, Carlisle first aid packs found around here as well. Uh, it could also be parts of them. I think they're deep as such. It's just straggly. Uh, how the hell do they do it? One hand digging and... Broken glass. Yes, I should have my white gloves on. There's a bit of a shaving cream or toothpaste container. I wonder if that was what was ringing off. Not so hard to find. Right, just sitting here having a feed. I mean, you can see the sort of terrain that uh, is now what was part of this infantry camp in World War II. Uh, just about buggered today. I think we might uh, call it an early stumps. Right, here's a wrap up of today's finds. Uh, it wasn't a hell of a lot. I didn't spend a lot of time there. Uh, unfortunately, wasn't feeling the best either. So over here we've got a rather large socket. The holes for turnings. A couple of pieces of wire that were in the hole, copper. 
Uh, toothpaste tube. And a lid there somewhere. A little one next to it. Now this strange piece. Obviously a handle. A key handle. And it's got a, uh, a nice crown figure in the middle there. So if anybody knows what that is. Uh, a horseshoe. Obviously locals rode horses through there. we got a 50 cal projectile. Uh, some 50 cal body. So that means that was obviously a bush fired one. A couple of 3.0 cartridges. A tent eyelet. And the coolest of the cools. A 1917 penny. I don't know if that's focusing or not. Uh, yeah, so that was pretty good. Uh, so overall for the month, uh, the big find would be 17 penny, an unmarked dog tag, marked dog tag, and the Aussie button. There. So that's it.